And if anyone in the room is getting lightheaded, you must sit down. You get in big trouble if you pass out. One of the patients is allowed to pass out. Squeeze yeah. mine as tight as you want. You doing okay, hon? Okay. And what I've been told, I've never had pins removed, but I've been told it's kind of like a release of pressure as they kind of come out. Is that what it felt like to you? I don't know if it's pressure or not. It just okay. hurts. It just hurts. I'd keep these band-aids on here probably till tonight. Then you can take them off, okay? Mm-hmm. You'll see when the holes at the tips close, and that's when you can kind of take a shower. No bathtub's kind of soaking for a while, but definitely wait a couple days for that. I don't know how to zoom on that. Are you still taking the pain medication? I don't have any. You don't have any left? Uh -uh. Okay. Do you need a refill on it? Breathe easy. Breathe. So the trick is you kind of twist a little bit and then use longitudinal traction. Oh. Oh, okay. In. I'm going to push against our toe tip a little bit. Oh. You all right, Jim? Squeeze as hard as you got it. Do you need a break? Are you ready for the next one? Yeah. Okay. is not to yank, yank, you know, just like a steady motion, so mm -hmm. it tends to be the least painful, kind of just a little bit of a twist if you need to. Is it still recording? Mm-hmm. Oh. Mm. Remember being a student in the first had a new rotation. It was the first time I'd done a path on at this new rotation. I'd done them before, but it was the first time. And there was this woman, she just started screaming right in the middle of my day, her, her path, and I just freaked out as a student. And then, then the doctor took over, and she ended up screaming for him too. That she was just this kind of, and just warning Heidi that if if you're kind of making your grunts, just the best is just to be go steady and just keep going. There you go. Squeeze small. Squeeze a little bit of a twist and then just solid traction back. It's hard. Grandma on either side of the ball like that it has to be flatter that way where the metal is. There you go. Man, I can't get over how long them things are. Hard. Not one into your nail. Got three more. Do you want to take these home? Yes. They're very sharp. Don't let grandkids play with them, stuff like that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Squeeze. There we go. Two more. <clears throat> what have you been taking for pain? She can't really uh, take anything. Yeah, because she, she, she put me on. I couldn't. She's allergic to everything. What happens in terms of the allergy? I get I vomit bad. Okay. It's nauseous. You ready? You want a break? I think you have one left, right? No, two, two more. Go ahead. Put my foot on you. Squeeze. Here it comes. Got one left. At my last job, I did only hands, and we did a lot of patients after um, pinnings and stuff like this. And taking out pins was my favorite thing to do. I think this is just the I'd like to do it too.
won't hurt me. Well, it usually doesn't hurt the people quite too much, but she, I think, has so much trauma. I think it's going to be a little more painful. Here we go. Here it comes. You're done. Good girl. Nice stuff. Those are stiff in there too. Yeah. Well, they go through a couple joints, so she starts to tighten to it, makes it harder to get them out. <sighs> and sometimes when they've been walking on them, they'll leave in bed. So it's almost like she's got in the bed one. Okay, Mom, what are you doing? Hold on. That um.